Hello, this is Denny Lenny Productions, and we are bringing your, you our first review on these 50 cent speakers that we bought in the Mexico City airport on our class trip to Cuernavaca. You can check out that series about our trip right here. Anyway, uh, so these are the Go Stereo 50 cent speakers from the Duty Free store in the Mexico City airport, as I said before. And we're going to be doing a little review on them today, um, a little unboxing of the package that they come in. We have two, one for each of us. Um, and uh, test out how uh, they work. Hint, uh, or spoiler alert, whatever you want to call it, they're terrible. So, yeah. Okay, so here we have our package with the Ghost Area speaker in it that we will be unboxing. And then we have our scissors to open the package. <laughs> I love how detailed we're getting. And then we have my phone. Part in the crack, <laughs> longboarding accident. I am okay, thanks for asking. Um, I have a phone to test it. Uh, and uh, AAA batteries to put in it, to power on. Okay, first cuts into the package. This is a very tough package. Very hard to open for those of you who um, maybe are on the weaker side. You might not want to buy this because it's really hard to open. <laughs> Just FYI. You see how tough it is? This plastic is killer. It's like metal, but worse. Okay, so now that we have the back open, we have this little piece of paper. Let's read some of it. Bonus, input cable included, compatible with all MP3s, the mini iPod, iPod video, iPod nano, uh, go stereo jet speaker, uh, built-in stereo speaker compatible with all iPod. I love how it's not plural. Universal wide base works with all iPod and MP3s. Features a retractable 3.5 input cable that tucks away for allowing the use of any MP3. Runs on three times AAA batteries, not included. I don't get my batteries when I pay 50 cents for the speaker. Come on, people. <laughs> okay, put that aside. Now we have the speaker itself. It looks pretty fancy. Uh, so in here you can see that we have the little uh, mic, or audio cable jack, and your, uh, theoretically your iPod or whatever would sit here and plug into it, but as you know, the iPhone 4s have the, uh, headphone cable but in the top. But there's something that saves that. There's something that saves that. In the bottom, you have this little compartment, and this little white, uh, cable comes out, and you can plug it into the back here and then into your iPod or phone or whatever and listen to your music and stuff. Uh, and then you have the on-off switch on the back. Over here, Denny. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> you have your on-off cable on the back. Um, down here you have uh, where you put the batteries in and while we're talking about that, we will slide those in right there for our test. You know, your basic speaker electronic kind of thing. Put that back on. Um, and then on the front, you have the light that lights up to say that it's on. You can, I mean, honestly, you can tell that it's kind of a crappy speaker right when you turn it on. Because if you can hear this, I don't know if you can. But that crackling sound when you turn it on just like kind of tells you the speakers are really bad. Uh, so, now that we have the batteries in, and we've showed you around this- Oh, by the way, this is the speaker thing. Um, we'll show you how it works out with my phone. And no, my phone is not crappy quality. It's an iPhone, people, so, seriously. It's the speakers. It's all the speakers. Oh my god! <laughs> Do you hear that, people? It's not really going anymore. Nope? Okay, wow. Hit me with your best song. You got that <laughs> reference there? Oh, oh you what hear is that? that man. What what song? Something that everyone will like. Like what? Do shuffle. See what comes. No, that's <laughs> a really bad idea on my phone. <laughs> um, maybe some Skrillex. Oh yeah, for some for some bass. We'll give you some Skrillex for some bass. No, we don't like that. So right
right off the bat, you can kind of tell that the bass is really bad. It's really high pitched, kind of that like crappy stereo speaker kind of like feeling, right? <laughs> It's kind of crackling too, uh, so you know, it's not the best. Honestly, the quality is like worse than any speaker I've ever heard, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to buy some cents speakers from the Mexico City Airport, go right on ahead. You go down to Mexico and buy those speakers. We bought all the ones they had in the store, FYI. Which that is would four. be four. <laughs> These two are mine. <laughs> the guys were like laughing at us when we bought them. They were like, Pur. they must have known they were crappy. We had to like ask for like they had to ask for our like passport though. I know we had. To, I had to go back to get my passport, and then I had to go get my boarding pass. It was ridiculous. Anyway, that's duty free for you. Traveling out of the country is ridiculous if you didn't know that. Yeah. So we'll give you some more sound for the end, and thank you for watching.